As far as this Heritage team goes, what do you take from last season that you can apply to this year? Um, everyone just works really hard together at practice and in the games. We just go after and get at it. No. As far as this team goes, if you're a Heritage fan, what are you going to notice differently about last year's team as opposed to this year's team? Mm, you know, we got a lot of speed coming back. Um, just everyone has been working over the summer with different things that they think uh, they need help with the most, so just working on those. As a leader for this team, what, what kind of wisdom or knowledge do you impart to some of the younger players that are going to have to step up and play bigger roles for you guys this year? Just work hard, work on the things that you need to work on. Uh, just listen to the coach because he knows what he's talking about. He's really good at it. What are the biggest goals for this Heritage team here in the 2014-2015 season? Um, just to win every game that we can. Just make sure that we stay a team and don't argue. If someone is doing something wrong, just let them know. Don't freak out on them or anything. So. What's the biggest strength of this Heritage team, you believe, heading into the season? Mm, the inside game, I think, is the most. So. Anything else you'd like to add? No, go Heritage. Um, as far as this Heritage Patriots team goes, uh, tell me a little about what we're going to see out there on the basketball court this season as opposed to last year. Uh, you're not going to see a whole lot different because we only had one senior last year. So we're returning most of our players, our core group from last year, which was uh, Tatanai Hall, Hannah Beckman, Kendall Kanapke. They're all three back. Uh, we're going to have a lot of, we're going to go from having one senior last year, we're going to probably have six seniors on the team this year. So hopefully we're going to see a little more experience, a little more savvy out on the floor. Having that continuity this season, how does that help you take the next step, which I know you want to take as a program? Uh, it's big in taking the next step, and that's one of the things we've talked about. Uh, people have talked to me and said, you know, how do you feel in terms of the conference? I definitely think that we've got a team that can compete for it, but until we beat a Leo, or like last year it was Garrett, now they're obviously out of the conference, mm -hmm. until we beat one of those teams, I think, you know, that's, that's what's there in front of us. That's a step we've got to take. So, For this team, what's the focus? I mean, on Monday when you guys open up practice for good, what is going to be focus number one for this Heritage team? Focus number one is probably going to be, like I said, we've got a good core group there. It's going to be filling the spots in around them. The developing, uh, going into right now, I'm not even sure who I would say our four and five starters are. Right? That's going to be up for grabs. We've got a lot of kids capable of filling those spots, just filling them. And then it was important, too, having a good bench that you can go to. So it's just going to be getting in there and just developing those kids, see who falls in where. I appreciate